welcome to Grace Christian Preschool. I'm Heidi Hoover, and I'm the director of the preschool. Welcome to our Tuesdays Threes class. The Tuesdays Threes class at Grace Christian Preschool is our launching pad class. It is for our youngest preschoolers who must be age two by September 1st at the start of the school year. We also have several children in here who are not potty trained as three-year-olds, and so it's a class that is welcoming to both two and three-year-olds. When children come into our class, they're all given at the start of the school year a brand new Grace Christian Preschool tote bag. And one of the big things for them to learn is to find their cubbies and to hang their tote bag in there, which holds their belongings um, and their changes of clothes from home. When children do that and say goodbye to mommies and daddies at the door, they learn to come on over to our circle area. And here is where they work on the first lessons of the day. Usually the teachers will start off with different songs and getting them excited to learn and ready to be here because sometimes it's a little hard when you're a two-year-old and have to say bye to a loved one at the door. So the teachers will get them engaged right away at the circle when it's, and it's usually with singing different songs. When they're done with that, the teachers will work on the calendar, the weather, will work on the days of the week, the months of the year, and also the children will be introduced to the pledge of the flag. It's not something that they're necessarily going to be able to recite as a two-year-old, but with the daily practice of that, they start getting more familiar with the words as the year goes on. When children are done at the circle, the teachers will give them the opportunity to go and explore what the kids really want to do, which is playing with all the toys in the classroom. And we have a variety of options. There are things from blocks and tiles and foods and baby dolls and cars and dinosaurs to puzzles and books. We've got a nice kitchen play area that the, kid, the children pretend to cook meals for us and lots of different trucks and airplanes and cars um, that get run all around the classroom. Usually as the children are playing independently, the teachers will pull one or two children at a time and come on over here to our tables and they'll work on anything from finger painting to practicing um, identifying their names, uh, doing creative artwork, all kinds of activities that they'll do at the table as their peers are working on playing at the independent, uh, independent play areas. After the teachers are done working with all the children at the workstations, it's usually time for snack. And at that time, it's fairly easy to get everyone to clean up all of their toys because they know the snack is on the way. We at Grace are a peanut-free facility, so we provide the snacks and it's always something peanut-free. The children will come on up here after washing their hands carefully and they'll sit down, we'll say a word of grace, and we'll have our snack and also a cup of water with that. Once we're done with that, as you can see, we have a changing table in our classroom. The teachers are always looking throughout the class time to see when children need to be changed. Also in this classroom, children are learning to use the potty. So we ask our parents to let us know when you're working with potty training at home so we can work on taking them out to our big kid potties in the hallway and practice with that. After we're done with our snack time and any changes, it's time to go play. And our children love to play down at our little playground, which is right outside downstairs. There are all kinds of things to play on and climb on, and if it's a nice day, we get to spend some quality time outside. If it's not a nice day, we at Grace do have another option. We have a large all-purpose room gymnasium, and we do get the opportunity to go down there and let children run around and play with things like hula hoops and jump ropes and items in an obstacle course. When they're done with that, our twos and threes are pretty exhausted, and we'll come back to the classroom go back to the circle time and be able to just get everybody calmed down, maybe read a story, maybe do some shaky eggs or animal action and remind the children what they learned that day because oftentimes they will not remember to tell their mommies and daddies what they learned in class. But we'll talk about it at the end of the class day, do our goodbye song where we say goodbye to every single child and sing each child's name at the end of class and then have our dismissal. 
That is a typical day here in our two hour, twos, threes, grow and go class at Grace. We hope that you enjoyed your tour, and if you have an interest in registering for the twos, threes class, you can see the registration form online at gracehummelstown.org, or you can reach me at Heidi Hoover at gracehummelstown.org. Thank you so much for visiting and have a blessed day.